Let's bring in NFL media insider Ian Rappaport now to find out the likelihood that that appeal will be in any way successful. Ian? Lindsay, there's always a chance, and this really is why the appeals process is what it is. And I should mention, it is going to be either Roger Goodell or one of his designees, potentially Harold Henderson, who recently denied Adrian Peterson's request for a reduced suspension. That's the most recent example. But there are other examples of suspensions being either reduced or overturned. Of course, during the 2015 playoffs, and Dominican Sue was allowed to play versus the Cowboys, a suspension overturned there. Anthony Hargrove, similar to, the, of course, the former Saints player, similar to Tom Brady in that uh, he did not cooperate with an NFL investigation. He had his suspension reduced from eight games to two games. So there is always a chance for Tom Brady. Let me just quickly lay out some of the issues that he is going to argue. First of all, as Don Yee mentioned in his letter, Brady is going to argue that there's a lack of evidence that he, in fact, directed the balls to be deflated. He's going to go after the NFL's lack of protocol as far as how it handles the footballs. And then the argument will be that there was a sting uh, involving the Colts and the NFL to catch the Patriots in the actor in the AFC title game. So that's what they will argue as they try and appeal this suspension uh, down. Well, we have heard a lot about two games potentially, but as of right now, it's set at four. So it looks right. like th we'll see Jimmy Garoppolo for at least a game or two. Uh, what do the Patriots think about uh, where he stands in his development and how much they like their chances with him on the field? Well, right now the Patriots are certainly planning on having Jimmy Garoppolo under center, at least for some portion of the 2015 season, specifically the opener against the Steelers. And there's a lot of confidence about Garoppolo inside the building. Talk to a source who has watched him practice over the last year or more. Here's what I was told. He's talented, smart, tough. He can run the offense and will be ready if called upon. And by the way, the Patriots are going to get a little bit of a sneak peek into their future. They do believe that Jimmy Garoppolo will be a big part of their post-Tom Brady life. And now, because of this, he gets a little bit of a trial run. Jimmy Garoppolo went 19 of 27 for 182 yards with one touchdown last year in his rookie year. A second round pick in the draft in 2014.